Welcome, I'm Elizabeth Harper. I'm thrilled that you've joined me on numerologist.com. I'm here with this week's angel messages. So this week's messages are all about, oh, what are they all about? Let me see, let me check. They are about, hmm, taking time for yourself. There's a sense that they are about that energy of, what do I need to do for me right now? It's all about you. So tune into your angels, invite your angels to guide you. Place your hands over your heart, just like angel wings, and invite your angels to guide you to message one, two, or three, a message that comes from their heart to yours. What you can also do is invite your angels to guide you as you move your cursor along in the video until you intuitively feel it's time to stop and right there is an extra message for you from your angels. All right, so we have three little cards. I love these cards. Let me see, this is all about you, right? So what's the first card? I was feeling it was the love card. This is about you loving yourself. It's about you going within and recognizing the love that is within you, that every cell of your being is filled with love. And look at that card. Love is just exuding from every cell. And that's what your angels are saying. They love you so much. And they want you to realize that that love while it may be external, a little bit internal, of course, it has to come from you. That vibration of love has to come from you, from within you. They can love you because they know who you truly are. They can see your light. They can see you for who you are, no matter what. They see your soul. They don't see your physical presence. It's not about your physical body or what you've done on the earth plane or how successful you've been or how unsuccessful you've been or what's worked or what hasn't worked. It's about your true self. And your angels just want you to know they love you unconditionally. And they're inviting you to love yourself unconditionally. Love your truth. When that love exudes from the core of your being, your body feels it. Your light feels it. Every layer of your being feels it. Your life feels it. And it is reflected in your life with that energy of love. That's the message for you. Number two, let's see what you've got. <sighs> feels like this one. Depth. Ooh, now look at that angel. That angel is just, it's got a tank on there filled with air. It's ready to dive in. To the depths of the water. Now water is a reflection of your emotions. So your angels are saying, let's dive into your emotions. Let's take a look at those emotions. It's good for you to dive in every now and again and not to avoid it. Don't be afraid of it. Your angels are saying this might be a sensitive time for you. You might be feeling more emotional than usual. They're saying that they are protecting you. They are supporting you, but they just want you to recognize where those emotions are coming from and how you can navigate them, work with them, understand them, and heal them if needs be. I feel as well, when I was looking at this, you know, there's a sense of your angels saying to you that you have to look after yourself first, that you can't look after everybody else until you've looked after yourself. It's very important for you to care for you before others. And I've said this before, you know, when you're on an airplane and they tell you to, if there's a problem and the oxygen mask comes down, they always tell you to put that oxygen mask on yourself first before you help others. And that I feel is what's coming from this oxygen mask just here. And your angels are saying, look after yourself first. Let's look at your emotional life. Let's look at your emotional body. Let's look at you. Let's look at how we can support you. Ask for their help. They're right there with you. 
all the time. All right? Okay. Our final card is relaxation. Ooh, isn't that lovely? So your angels are saying, take a load off. We've got this beautiful angels in a hammock just floating away. Now, with that relaxation, it's not necessarily to leave your job for a week or, or stop doing what you're doing. This is very much about taking time out for yourself. And that time out might be five minutes, might be 10 minutes, could be longer. Whatever it is, it's relaxing in that time. And it could be just a breath, one breath. And that's helping you to relax. I feel almost as if, you know, with relaxation, when I look at this, there's this sense that the angel is and you, that, you know, you need some time to recuperate, that you need some time to rejuvenate. And your angels are just saying, look, you can't keep going all the time. When you go to sleep at night, that's not relaxation that taking time during the day just for yourself, just to be in your own body, your own, your own light, your own soul. Maybe do a little meditation with that relaxation and notice how your body responds to that. If you've been feeling aches and pains, if you've been feeling tired, if you've been feeling that something isn't working for you, maybe you just need to relax. And with that relaxation, you let go. And that's going to help you in every area of your life. Okay, that's it for this week's angel messages. I hope you enjoyed them. Let me know in the comments below if the messages resonated for you. And of course, remember to subscribe to the numerologist.com channel. Lots of goodies there for you. I will see you next week. Lots of angel blessings to you. Bye for now. Bye.